Hi guys, Matt from 123MyOT here. Welcome to the channel. In this video, I want to help you with getting your Mac, MacBook Pro, MacBook Air to start if it's coming up with a blank screen, black screen, grey screen when it's starting up. I will show you what I do to fix Macs when they won't start. Here we have both the M2 Apple Silicon Mac and an older Intel Mac. They are a little bit different to fix, so let's get started. The first tip is a force shutdown. This is where you hold the power button down until the Mac turns itself off. This is the same for most laptops, not just Macs. So let's just pretend that the Mac has a blank screen and won't start. By pressing and holding the power button down, I will count to 10 or 15 seconds, and then I will let go and then press the power button again to turn the Mac back on. Cool, now you can do the same with Intel Macs. Okay, so let's just pretend again that you've got a blank screen. Press and hold the power button. Cool, and there you have it. So it should start up now. Tip two is using Mac OS recovery. So we need to press, let go, and press and hold the power button. I will show you this again. Press, let go, press and hold. If you did it right, you should see a continue holding for startup options message. When that comes up, you can try clicking on the Macintosh HD and then hit continue. If that doesn't get you back into your Mac, then repeat tip two and click on options and then continue. Tip three will be disk utility and we will run a repair on the disks of your Mac. So what you wanna do is go up to the little drop down menu and click on show all devices. So you wanna run the first aid on each disk, starting with the last one first. Let me show you. Click the last disk then click first aid button and then click run. When it's finished, click done and then repeat the steps until all your disks have had the first aid run on them. Once you have done all the disks, close down the disk utility and go up to the Apple menu and restart your Mac and hopefully your Mac will restart and you are good to go. Recovery mode for Intel Macs has different buttons. We want to hold down the Command and R after we press the power button. Let me show you. Cool, and there it is. So just go ahead and repeat the same process for Intel Max. Start the disk utility, show all devices, and then run the first aid on every disk, starting with the last one first, and then restart your Mac and hopefully you'll have fixed your Mac. Okay, tip four is to reinstall Mac OS. Reinstalling Mac OS won't remove the data from your Mac, but if you're unsure about this next step, you can always take your Mac into Apple and get them to help. Go back into your startup options, and instead of clicking on Disk Utility, click on Reinstall Mac OS. 
It will reinstall Mac OS and restart your Mac and then hopefully it will be working then. Tip five is for Intel Macs only and it requires you to do a SMC reset and an NVRAM reset. I've already done two videos for this and I will add the links at the top of this video or in the description below. Guys, I hope this video helped to get your Mac working. If it helped, please leave a thumbs up and don't forget to check out my other videos such as make a copy of Mac OS before it disappears. And do me a favor, if you know anyone who might like this video, please share it with them, hit the subscribe button and smash the bell icon.